right, this is just a quick video. That's not my postcode, by the way. This is just a quick video. Uh, so I'll search on all these cars here. And the video is about somebody who just sent me a comment in the, the last video I just posted saying that, why is there so many electric cars uh, with low mileage on it for sale? Blah, blah, blah. But we'll just have a look on Autotrader just to, you know, see if his conspiracy theory is correct or not. So we'll click on year and we'll go uh, from 2023 to 2024 and we'll click in mileage 100 miles. So that's as much as miles as they've done. Uh, we'll go down to fuel type and when we click fuel type, it tells you that there's 1,072 petrol cars under 100 miles, 215 diesel cars, 522 electric cars and 671 hybrid cars. So even hybrid cars are higher than electric and petrol is double the amount. So for the person who said I don't know where this conspiracy theory comes. There's loads of conspiracy theories about electric cars, and they seem to spread like wildfire. Um, there's, oh, it's, there's loads of silly things going around, like all electric cars are getting hidden somewhere. <laughs> but you can see by here, look, I, this is it here. This is for the person who just sent me a message just now saying that how come there's so many electric cars for sale under, under, under with a low mileage on it. But there we go, double the amount of petrol. Obviously, diesel is not going to be that many because not many people buy diesel anymore. And it's not that many diesel cars for sale. But there we go. That's it there. That's my little bit of research. Uh, maybe these conspiracy theorists can point me directly to what they're looking at so I can have a look at it myself. Because when I look, I can't find what's going on in their brain. I just can't. Anyway, just a quick video.